appreciate everybody being here. Hey, knock out that last round of NT. Uh, it's dude, the NT mixture is the stupid price. NT with contenders optic first off the line, Panini one, and a box of optic uh, football as well. Not bad. Uh, remember to, for some reason, if you don't hit something at a break, I always pop something in there for you guys as well. Everything's already shipped out from last week. I was on top of my game. Uh, so here we go. NFL four box break number one. I uh, got the national treasures up in that joint too. So Trox 21, Venus, discount man. Venus, Bob Grizz, growing out that beard, I imagine. Cornerback, Ed Marinich, Sully. Discount Frankie, Redskins fan, D-Watt, T-Bank, Hot Sauce, First T-George, Floyd Town, Donovan, Jay-Z, hasn't shaved in two weeks. <laughs> Now, hopefully you got one of the cool beards that, like, comes in and it's not, like, one of those weird scraggly beards where there's, like, a bird living on the left side and then clean shaven on the right-hand side, right? Yeah, so hopefully that's not the case there for you, Jay-Z. <laughs> mm. All right. So, well, let's get up into this optic. She's kind of stoked about optic again, too. All right. So yeah, hey, that last round of um, that last round of the select hybrid is up there with the Don Russ choice. So like I said, I was kind of tiptoeing around select hybrid um, based off the price point where everything was at. I was like, you know what? I want to put in some good stuff with it too, just in case you know stuff goes sideways with select or whatever it may be. From what I saw and what I broke, I think it looks really good. But like I said, the price point's getting getting a little high right now, so I want to make sure to kind of safeguard you guys as well. So that's why I kind of tiptoed around it instead of doing like a $150 or $200 half case break or something crazy like that. So, um, all right, let's go ahead and knock it around. <laughs> H House, I swear. Now, H House, have you done an online comedy tour yet? Just like a show, just sell some tickets online. Do whatever, man. Binge Tiger King. So I finished Ozark. I don't know if anybody else is watching Ozark, but uh, I did finish that. Here's Tyrell Williams, 188 out of 199. And the only time I can really watch anything is basically from the hours of like 12:30 or one o'clock after we get done with breaks. Uh, <laughs> So, but anyway, I did finish it, and uh, I was anxious to get your guys' thoughts on that as well, if you're into that Ozark stuff. If you haven't seen it, I don't want to do any spoilers or anything weird like that, so. I tried to start, I tried to start watching Tiger King, but stuff was out of control. Here's Nick Bosa. I'll take a little hollow all day long. Kick that thing off. In the middle of Ozark, yeah. I thought the the other seasons. Here's a blue guy, though. I don't take a little blue guy, Darius Slayton. So sixty-eight out of seventy-five, Darius Slayton going over to them Giants. That'll be Venus. Um, yeah, I like mixed. I thought I thought Ozark season three was a little bit slower. And that's. Basically it. I wish there was more. I think the reason why Ozark got gained so much popularity is because of the everybody loves to kind of put themselves in that position of uh, here's Debo. I mean, you know, seeing how the money works and seeing how the money goes in and out, and there just wasn't a lot of that in season three. So uh, 99 out of 199. So I wish there was more of that. And it was just uh, it was kind of a mess. It was a mess, but. Uh, Looks like there might be a season four. There's Mike Edwards. Uh, H House is giving fake spoiler alerts. That's basically what just happened there. <laughs> All right, here's Aaron Jones. 125 out of 299. Court's on episode three of season three. All right. My wife tried to watch it with me the very first night, and uh, she fell asleep halfway f through the first episode just because she's narcoleptic. And so, uh, 150, Nasir Adderley. And so, uh, next thing you know, the next morning, she's like, what episode are you on? I was like, uh, episode four. <laughs> so, really put in some work. Here's Devin Singletary. 
There's River City. What's up, dude? Drew Locke. So I've been able to start picking up some really good deals to uh, as I was building out Ultimate Eight. I was like, oh my goodness, I'm able to I'm able to fire in some good stuff right now. Two ninety nine Rodney Anderson, especially on the football side too. Able to build out some good stuff, and like I said, I think it'll be refreshing whenever we see a thirty dollar football and thirty five dollar Ultimate Eight basketball. I think you guys will be pleasantly surprised. I don't I can't imagine it would stay up there very long. So, like I said, hopefully at some point this week we'll be able to do that. Here's Joe Montana. Dude, but this is kind of tight, though. This is going to be the one of the out of 25s. Seven out of 25. Brodio Montana. So, San Fran. And Sully 2-4. There you go. All right. There's that little guy. But we still got a lot left. Uh, yes, Pilsen, that's my next agenda, is to build out some Ultimate 8 Baseball. Dude, I had a blast with baseball whenever we did it the other week, so I definitely want to, uh, like, I wanted to get rounds of uh, basketball built out. I want to get some rounds of, uh, of uh, football built out as well. And so uh, my baseball stuff, I, it'll be so much fun, too. Yeah, so I'll definitely get some of that baseball out there, too. <laughs> What's up, AD? How you doing, buddy? All right, here's a Panini one box. We're in the first four box NFL mixer. Yep. Okay, you got Austin Eckler, 46 out of 50, going over to them Chargers. Hugh, 1701. So if you guys haven't already, knock. Hey, would you guys knock out those free rewards breaks so I can do the hobby box toss up? The uh, there's a contenders first off a line box in there. Uh, you know, which only has a couple spots left too. So if you guys knock out that, then I can do all those together. I can do the plates and patches toss up, the contenders draft basketball, the first off a line. And then I get some more stuff up there for you guys too. All right, here's the first off the line contenders optic. What does ultimate eight mean? It's a very, very deep question by Bob Griggs. Ultimate eight. Well, there's a little play on words with ultimate box breaks. So ultimate, and then there's eight hits in there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, shake and bake. You got Landon Collins. And that'll be out of 199 over to them skins. And you got Von Miller, Cortland Sutton over to them Braun shows at a 165. I'll take that all day long. You give me a little shake and bake first off a of line. Jamie R with Cleveland. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Other other Kev swinging in. What's up, buddy? 18 out of 21. Shake and bake. And then a Riley Ridley over to those Bears. So Floyd Town. And a Deontay Thompson to Arizona. Which will be Trox 21. 18 out of 21. All right, well now we lean on the National Treasures goodness. But like I said, I, I told you guys I wanted to get away from the, uh, from the master case breaks because it didn't let uh, the majority into the break. And so I thought I'd add some other good, really good products. Optic, Panini One, Contenders Optic, First Off Alliance, all really good stuff. So, all right, let's get up in here. So yeah, that last round of National Treasures is up there for you guys right now. Mm-hmm. Same with the last round of the Select Hybrid too. All right. Lots of luck. So we'll do one more round of the football and then we'll jump over to the basketball and then we'll come back and knock out the last football too. So knock that thing down. Probably won't be a, a crazy long night and I kind of did that on purpose just so I could get back and make sure that Isla was in uh, nothing nothing going sideways back at the back at the homestead too. So, all right, here's Steve Atwater. And that's out of 75 over to the Broncos. And Vaughn Miller, 16 out of 58 over to Denver. Dak Prescott, 23 out of 99 over to Dallas and Hot 
Sauce Daddy. There you go, dude. 23 to 99. Really nice patch in there of Julius Peppers. 12 out of 25. Over to Carolina. So Mead Taylor, 216. And done. Yeah, Miles Sanders out of 99. 66 out of 99. I know, Trox. Let's do the damn thing, right? Come on. Come on, Cletus. All right. Is this old school? Is this Charles Woodson? What do we got there? Yep. So 101, Charles Woodson going over to Green Bay. So Hot Sauce Daddy. There you go, dude. Remember too, if you guys don't hit something out of the break, uh, or don't you know, get, don't get a card or anything crazy, you know, anything out of the breaks, I was tossing extra stuff. I'm sure you guys have seen that trend over the past couple weeks too, uh, as well. So and and you got Quadri Allison, 33 out of 49 over to Atlanta. So Lakers Rams man hitting down there at the 30th spot. Uh, that's not bad. That'll make Popeye get a little goofy. All right, so Tony Pollard, 8 out of 10 over to Dallas. Hot Sauce Daddy. There you go, dude. Nice jumbo patch in there of Tony Pollard. And Mike Allstott, 18 out of 49. Over to Tampa Bay. I'll tell you what, I like this next one. We had a we had a chance to sit down with this this young gentleman as well. He's a big fan of DIY, and he likes to golf too. He's a Syracuse guy, right? Or not Syracuse? Sorry, Clemson. <laughs> Thinking or orange all the way. Oh, this card's bad, dude. Normally, I wouldn't uh, mag up a Hunter Renfro, but hey, uh, hey, how about the true rookie RPA Hunter Renfro going over to Oak Town? One hundred one nameplate, true rookie. I like that a lot. M. Meredith hit a gold ice Donald in the 2020 Prism Draft Pick Pack. Nice, dude. How about the 101 True RPA? Hunter Renfro. I don't even care. It's the only one made, dude. That's the true rook. I'm going to take that. Damn. I was after that Mike Allstott over to Tampa Bay, which was Dancing Monkey, but... That's a really nice hit, dude. I'm actually, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna tweet at old Hunter Renfro, and let him know, pulling his stuff. Some Raiders fans going gonna burn up their toilet paper stash after seeing that. Whenever it hits the bay or whatever it's gonna do. All right, that was round number one. I'm gonna just keep it rolling in the same. Video. So we'll do uh, round number two, and then uh, we'll jump over to the basketball side, and then come back, knock out that last round too. So if you guys haven't knocked out the um, the, I forget what round number it was, eight or something like that, of the basketball, I'm gonna do it. All right. So we got NT Optic, Panini <clears throat> One, and Contenders First Online. Actually, you know. 